everyone, my name is Gabriel Sarmina, and I'm here to speak to you about a artifact that is important to my culture and maybe is important to some of yours as well. So I will first speak to you about the history of my artifact and then I will speak to you about the significance this artifact has with my family and I. So by a show of hands, how many of y'all have seen this statue right here? Okay, most of you. Um, so first off, for those of you that don't know, this is um, La Virgen de Guadalupe, um, also known as La Reina de Mexico, um, translated to English, the Queen of Mexico. Um, so just to give y'all a little bit of history, I'm gonna move on to the history. Um, so I read a portion of the Bible and her story looks like this. So there was a man called Juan Diego, he was a farmer. Um, and one day he was on his way to his siembra, which is his land, to work. Um, so he goes to the siembra, he hears this beautiful voice and music. Um, he goes towards it and he sees that it's La Virgen de Guadalupe. La Virgen then tells Juan Diego to go to Mexico City and tell the priest to build her a temple in her honor. So Juan Diego goes to Mexico City, tells the priest, they don't believe him. So Juan Diego goes back to La Virgen. La Virgen then tells uh, Juan to pick roses from El Cerro de Tetrilla. Now El Cerro is a desert and it's a very hot place and well, roses shouldn't be able to grow there. So he picks roses from El Cerro de Tetrilla, takes them to the priest and as he's showing up, um, he takes them out of his mantle and there is a uh, painting or a icon of how La Virgen de Guadalupe looks. Um, and then they believe him, they built her a temple in her honor right there, and that is her story. So now that's the story of La Virgen de Guadalupe, next I will talk about her symbolism in the Mexican tradition. So La Virgen is usually seen with rays of sunlight surrounding her. Um, she is always wearing a green, um, a blue-green to turquoise mantle, um, and that signifies natural forces and eternity. Um, she also has stars on her mantle, and the stars on her mantle signify that she is from the heavens. Um, so today, her image is synonymous um, with Mexico itself, um, and to many Mexicans, she symbolizes freedom, and patriotism. Next, I will talk to you about how I and my family identify with this artifact. So I am Hispanic and Catholic, and this artifact is not only a religious figure, it's also important to me in my everyday life. So like, for instance, um, during a test, when I'll be stressed, um, I will usually pray and um, this will in turn help me uh, do better in my test. It will comfort me and it will help me do better. Um, so in conclusion, I talked about the history and importance of La Virgen de Guadalupe has in my culture and the significance it has in my daily life. So I want you all to go home and talk to your family or anyone and try to learn something new about your culture because culture connects us all in many different ways.